Hey guys, it's Danielle and today I have a brand new and exciting video for you and this is going to be my Gucci and Balenciaga unboxing of the Hacker Project. Um, yeah, I'm really, really excited to film this. I was going to wait until the weekend, but this little baby was waiting for me whilst I got home. So we're going to unbox it for you here on camera today and I hope you are as excited as I am. So make sure to give this video a big thumbs up, drop me a comment down below and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and we better get into this video. Okay, so as I said, I was going to wait until the weekend to film this. I'm currently filming on a new camera, which is why you might actually be able to see me. You can never usually see me in my videos. So yeah, I've upgraded my camera. So I did want to wait until the proper lighting for this to film this, but I couldn't wait to unbox this. So yeah, I literally haven't even unboxed the box. I usually will undo this and then leave the rest of it, but I haven't even done that. So let's get started because I'm excited. <laughs> So, here we go. Right, it's green on the inside of the box, which is usually the Gucci. Uh, so, I'm, this is the current Gucci print. So, can I even unbox this? I need scissors. What a surprise. <laughs> right, so hopefully that's done. There we go. Oh, okay. So this is one of those projects. It got re it got announced ages ago, um, and I wanted the hourglass bag as everyone did, I'm sure. Um, but you know, I'm a working girl. I can't afford can't afford an hourglass bag. Um, so I wanted to get something. I wanted to get something small just so that I had something from the collection. So I went for this, and I mean, you already know what it is. You've literally read the title, but. Oh, okay, okay, so this is what is in the box. So you've got the a little Gucci dust bag and then you've got all the paperwork inside. So, have this little Gucci 100 bag, which I think is from the Aria collection. I don't think that they were um, boxing this stuff um, in the Hacker Project stuff. I think they were just doing it in the Gucci Aria uh, stuff. So that's why you've got this little kind of tote bag. I got this straight from the Gucci website, by the way. So then we have these two little envelopes. If you've watched my unboxings before, you know I'm a sucker for all the little things that comes with it. Um, this is literally just a thank you card saying, thank you, we look forward to assisting you again at Gucci.com. I'm sure you do. <laughs> I'm sure they do. I'm sure they look forward to us spending our money. And then here is just my receipt which I'm not gonna show you because it has my address on it. Okay, so then we have the baby itself. <laughs> the baby itself. Oh, it's literally upside down. Okay, so we have the Gucci Balenciaga bow on it, um, and then we have the Gucci box, and then we have the gray Balenciaga box on the opposite side. I mean, how damn cute is that? I need to take a photo so excited <laughs> just excuse me while I take a photo <laughs> okay so now that I've taken a photo with this thing we can unbox it I don't want to ruin the ribbon I mean it's the cutest thing ever literally it's the cutest thing ever I just need to take a few I need to take a few more photos I'm sorry I'm sorry right so we're back we're back I've taken photos um I also I'm dying for this I'm just actually very excited it's only something small as you can see I don't have a lot of money <laughs> But I wanted to get something because this is such an iconic collaboration um, and it was going to be one of those things. I had left it a couple of days and I thought, no, you know what? I really want to get something and I wish that this was still in stock and it was. So yeah, ordered this from the Gucci website. Uh, we don't have any Gucci's close to where I live. I uh, would have had to go to London, which I didn't really want to do. So right, I'm just going to open this. I'm going to try and preserve the bow. There we go, how exciting. Right, so yes, Gucci box. Oh, and how sodden and adorable was that? <laughs> so you've got the Balenciaga box underneath and then you've got the, obviously yeah, the Gucci box on top. 
And then you've got this adorable little dust bag. Okay, so you've got this adorable little dust bag. Sorry, I just had to turn my product showcase mode on. Um, so yeah, this adorable little dust bag it says Gucci and then Balenciaga at the bottom. And then we are going to open her. And you're gonna see her before I am, which is really upsetting. But I mean, ah, I'm so excited. I'm so, so excited. Okay, wait, there's all the paperwork in here. We all know. I'll go through the paperwork first. So, silica gel, that's all well and good. And then we have the Le Cura del Prodotto, which is usually the Cara thing, I think. It's, yeah, how to store and clean this product. Yeah, all good. And then we have a uh, Communicazoin? Who knows? Who knows? I do not speak Italian. Uh, authenticity? I believe. Yeah, okay, so authenticity. And then, yes, we have the one and only baby right here. So she's a lot bigger than I thought. She's humongous. Um, so yeah, you've got the iconic B there, uh, which is obviously the Balenciaga, the Balenciaga B, and then you've got the GG Supreme print up here. Uh, and then you've got this little zip here, which undoes, and which is actually really handy. I've currently got a coin purse, or a card holder, sorry, that doesn't have this little coin purse bit and I could really do with it um, and then on the back here you've got all your card slots you've got one two three four card slots on the back and then you've got this little flap which is for notes I guess um, so yeah there's just two little bits of cardboard in here which is for obviously your cards it's very very self-explanatory it's literally a card holder. I'm gonna grab my other card holder just so you can see size comparison wise, but she's beautiful. She is very, very beautiful and I am very, very happy. <laughs> okay, so for reference, I have this coach card holder right here and then there's the new Gucci one. So as you can see, she's a lot bigger. She's a lot bigger. She's a hefty, she's a hefty girl. Yeah, she's quite a lot bigger, however, She's just so darn cute. I mean, this isn't one of those things that I could put in the back of my pocket and I wouldn't want to either just because I don't want to scuff her and mark her and ruin her. Whereas this baby's nice and old. She's nice and soft and worn by now. Um, yeah, this is my original card holder and I'll still probably be using this throughout the day, day-to-day uh, -day things. But when I want to whack out her, I will. <laughs> so this card case it's called the zip card case and it cost me 310 pounds so quite expensive however not terror not actually terrible for um not only a gucci card case but also a balenciaga the crossover they could have charged a lot more for these uh for well for any of the collection um and they haven't they've stuck to pretty much the standard price of things i think a regular gucci card case is um, around 280 to 300 depending on what you get obviously you can get ones for more than that you can don't think you can actually get any for cheaper than 285 but i might be wrong um yes i love her a lot i'll do a close-up shot so you can see what she looks like but she is absolutely incredible um i am gonna put i haven't got any cards that aren't actual cards so I'm gonna put my ID which is this here in my hand I'm gonna put her in it um, and there we go she fits really nicely <laughs> just enough so you can't see anything but she fits really nicely in there um, so yeah you can fit one two three four cards and then if you really wanted to you could fit some in this back pocket or some in the front pocket but I yeah, so that's a card. My ID is in the front pocket of that. Um, so yeah, she's cute. She's lush, and I love her. She's exactly what I wanted from a collaboration between Balenciaga and Gucci. 
I love that you can put stuff in here because I mean with that I've literally just got this slot at the top and I can't do anything with a slot at the top but I can do a lot with it I can do a lot if I ever ever carry change unlikely these days but if I ever do she can fit in here she's so cute oh my god I love her Okay, so just just for argument's sake, I mean, you're really not gonna do this. Uh, it's literally a card holder. You're probably just gonna use it for cards and notes. Um, I'm gonna see if I can fit anything else in here. Um, I mean, as you said, you wouldn't. I wouldn't anyway. Um, this is literally gonna be for my cards, any notes or coins I have. Um, but yeah, there's a zip pocket and we're gonna see what can fit inside her. <laughs> so she's quite a small zip. But this is a Burt's Bees like chapstick. And if you really want to, she can go in there, but she's causing a bit of a bulge, which is the issue with if you put anything in here other than cards, it's gonna bulge it. And I don't like doing stuff like that. Um, I mean, I've got a mini Bite Beauty lipstick. And again, I mean, fits in really nicely, but once again, you're uh, gonna bulge. And the same as like a MAC lipstick. So a MAC lipstick can just about fit in, but as I said, you've got a bulge, you've got a bulge. Nobody wants a bulge. So yeah, I mean, you can fit like a lipstick and then like your cards and your notes in here, but are you really gonna buy a card case to fit a lipstick in it as well? Who knows, I wouldn't, but some people might. So yeah, you can fit one inside of here, but yeah, this is just for cards in my opinion. So that is the end of this unboxing. I know it was a really cute little one, um, but yeah, uh, this is what I've picked up. As I said, I really, really love it. Really, really love it. Really, really love it. Um, and yeah, I'm not gonna be using it every day. Um, it's a bit more of a special keeper piece for me, but I will be using it on my likes out. Um, so yes. I hope you have enjoyed this video guys, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, drop me a comment down below and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye guys!